What's going on guys? Today, we're gonna be fishing the backyard. It's been a very, very long time since I made a video back here, but look at the waters, they're calm. So yeah, we're gonna um, we're gonna get in, we're gonna get into this video. I'm gonna be using a tandem rig, and I'm gonna be using the Outlaw paddle tail with that Blue Wave tackle um, tandem rig. So y'all stay tuned. Let's get into this video. Tight lines. Okay, so before I actually get into the kayak. I like to make a couple casts here, my favorite spot. Yeah, I kind of like to um to make a couple casts here before I actually go out on the kayak because here's where I I've always caught here, but been kind of slow lately i feel like they've already caught on and they moved they usually go over there to where that other dock is or over there where those trees are but every once in a while i'll, I'll make a cast here and i'll catch a bass a bass or two let's bring out the kayak it's time to get wet Imagine having to do that with the hoodoo. I got the hoodoo in here once. To put to put it back up was a nightmare. Now don't get me wrong. If I could, I'd launch the hoodoo from here every single time. But I can't. So until I actually build like a ramp or something little decent ramp where I can just slide it off it's gonna be the field and stream for now guys it's so hard to actually get the lure right there because well it's in the trees and to get snagged look at this take a look at this um the hook this is a victory v-lock they will hook onto anything and they won't let go you know i i kind of know what i'm doing here because i've been fishing this body of water for a little over a year man a little over a year well actually yeah it's been it's been quite quite some time a year and some months so i kind of know where the the snags are I've lost hundreds and hundreds of dollars of lures in here i even lost this setup i just i just got it back a couple days ago and it's weird how it happened because I put I put bait on it and I left it outside and I went inside to go to go do some stuff when I came back outside the rod was gone now after getting in the kayak coming out here and I was um making some casts and I hooked onto the green line but what was on the green line was this Oh yeah, we got a first bite. And it's a channel, baby channel to, to start off the day. Nice catch. 
but not what we're looking for. <sighs> nice channel. Yeah, so I'm gonna insert the clip here. All right, guys, so um, I lost my fishing rod in the morning. I came out fishing with my outlaw fishing lure with my other rod. I snagged my line. Unfortunately, the line to the rod was popped, but this guy is the reason for that. Huge blue cat, guys. Huge. He's a big boy. I think it's only right that, you know, he took my rod, so I gotta take I gotta take him for dinner. What do y'all think? Let me know. And that is what was on the end of my line. That's what took my rod in. So yeah, I came outside. It got on my kayak, and I was there casting and casting and casting and. It was gone then um about three days ago from today i was throwing my cast net and i was trying to catch bait so I, was, I was gonna fish for gar back here and lo and behold i'm pulling up something that has some weight to it and i'm like oh okay i got a I got a decent decent size probably a tilapia or cichlid who knows bring it out it's my this setup sitting the way it is and i'm like oh my gosh there is no freaking way it made my day actually actually it made my week i got my setup back and nothing was wrong with it it was in the water and i kid you not guys i kid you not this sedona was sitting in the water for a little over two weeks so i was surprised to get it back and it still be working obviously i opened it up i oiled it down and washed it but over two weeks in this water and it was like new like i mean that like it was never in the water now these bass are really uh, picky sometimes so who knows you never know what you're gonna catch back here man it's crazy how i've caught in I've caught flathead back here and everybody tells me like it's weird you know it I had seen them on on videos I just never knew that it was rare to find them down here but obviously I caught one and here are pictures of that fish that catch okay guys so so far we had those that channel cat looking for a bass We're looking for a bass I've caught a few big ones here a few big ones uh, as a matter of fact I'm gonna show y'all just how big I've caught them here before check this out now it's crazy because those are over there where that dock is that's where i that's where i caught them both actually not in the same day i wish but um i did catch those there i caught a few over there by my house like this was before i even had a kayak i broke my pb on on the uh, the bank i know if oof, that was probably like a bluegill or something i fish this almost every single day whether it's with lure whether it's with bait i'm always just trying to study the water Ooh, that was a that was a hit i don't have many people interacting with my videos i don't have many people that comment so i kind of want to put questions in here to kind of you know help my audience grow i want to interact with the audience so when it comes to this water if you look at it what baits do you think I should be using in here? Leave it down in the comments below. Share this video with your friends that might know. G give me some recommendations and I'll go ahead and I'll go buy the lure. And I'll use it out here in my, um, in my backyard. 
Ooh, that was a nice bass. I'll take a screenshot of who recommended what, and whenever I use that lure for that video, I'll post it and I'll be like, okay, this person recommended this. So let's go try it out and then I'll start the video. I want to get you guys to comment more on my videos so it can help me out on both um, catching fish back here and with the with the audience and interaction. Now where the best really like to hang out is right here. Let's see if we can. Uh, this is the spot I come to. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is what we're working with here. What? No way. I caught a Playco, guys. This is not good. Oh my gosh, this isn't good. Don't do that. I thought that was a big bass. 